one I wrote for someone. She knows who she is. If God had a lawyer, then clouds require a payment for every picture they paint. Nightingales owe royalties for the songs they cover. Autumn leaves file as content providers. And flowers secure branding for colors blossoming from their heart. Rain charges by the drop or the hour, depending on which is more. And snow carpets by the yard. The otter goes union, book shows through ticket masters, dolphins are holding out for signing bonuses, and everybody hopes the whales come back for another contract year. <laughs> Lightning sues thunder for appropriation, and roses secure garnered branding for things that smell nice. Don't bother stargazing until you've signed the waiver. The snow-capped mountain wants an ex parte advance, the log of the beach has restructuring costs, and the morning mist's agent demands 15%. If the sun needs compensation for drying our tears or glowing our skin, and the moon settles property rights, then love itself is going to need representation. If God had a lawyer, he'd have the whole world sorted and vetted, collated, regulated, licensed, and legislated with Ponzi schemes and credit card usury and American dreams. Cost of my life would be too much. I couldn't afford a cool breeze, let alone a sunrise. I'd get busted for trying to sneak into the ocean. Have to work day and night just to watch children play. Work and stick to a budget of noodles and ketchup. Sell my hands on eBay. Work late every Sunday to rent the smell of mum's cinnamon buns. I wouldn't at rest. I'd bag lunch every day, work through all my coffee breaks for echoes of church bells on Christmas morning. I'd become a bus shelter squatter, checking in phone booths for forgotten quarters to pay the cover to walk by your house. I'll never give up. I don't care if they call me a pass in the hat. You're going to finish that slimy rat. I'll learn to sew. I'll pan for gold to put together enough scratch to pay for one more moment in your eyes while you call me handsome. Half a block holding your hand, your thumb pressed into my palm. Sell the farm, hold my soul in escrow to feel you tucking tiny cold toes under my thighs while riffing your solo jazz laugh, smelling the color of your hair, tasting the caviar satin of your neck would run up my tab so high. Ha, never pay it off. Your kiss, I'd face big time litigation for the reflection of your kiss upon the imagination of my lips. So when you go, and you know you will, and to another your heart is sent, when my two-for-one hope has all been spent, bring me the bill, I'll pay it in full. No questions asked. No, I do not need a receipt.